25 million children under the age of five are malnourished in Nigeria, according to reports by the Federal Ministry of Health. This has been made worse by the insurgency in the Northeast. Correspondent Okemote Imone Rua looks at the importance of breastfeeding in fighting malnutrition. The importance of nutrition in national development cannot be overemphasized, as the World Bank reports that solving the problem of malnutrition will increase a country's GDP by 10% as they save the money that would have been spent on illnesses. Exclusive breastfeeding is the best way to start. Exclusive breastfeeding is when you give a baby breast without water or any other food. You don't give a baby any other food apart from breast. I did not give him anything. Water, I didn't give him water, nothing. It's only breast. Compliant mothers speak on the benefits of exclusively breastfeeding their children. But that one that I give food is very, very tough for me. He's sick every time, but the rest one, not in sickness. Yes, because the people is very nice. They don't used to sick or poison, all those things. Where they want to, they, they are teeth. Where they are bringing out it, I will not even feel anything. Babies that have been being under exclusive, they are healthy, they grow well, they don't fall is sick easily, they are okay. More than the ones that give water. This, however, has its challenges and would not be successful without the support of fathers. If father even tell me I should not hide giving food, I should breastfeed him because the experience he gets for the rest, they do not disturb him. That is why I'm giving them breast. If you see them, they are very healthy, fresh. In fact, I'm so impressed. But some will complain about work. They don't have time in their office. They don't have, so we tell them, hi, yes, you can do like three months before you do any other, give any other food. So exclusive is best for every child. The breast milk contains all the nutrients a child needs for development. And it has been proven that exclusively breastfed children have higher IQs and are less likely to fall sick. Goal two of the Sustainable Development Goals is zero hunger by 2030. And this goal will not be met if Nigeria doesn't solve malnutrition. Or Kiemute Imonirua, STV News, Abuja.